Hey everybody, Legendary Tutorial Maker 1-2 here, and I'm going to be demoing this Uberlisk for Prosaic Muse. Um, he's been working on this for quite a while, and as you can see, it uh, looks pretty good. It's got the spine crawlers there, and um, one thing he wanted me to mention is that the spine crawlers are actually not attached to the attachment points on the Uberlisk model. So the Uberlisk model will have like attachment points here and like certain areas like center, overhead, for doing things like auras and crap like that. But what he actually did was use a method called, well, not use a method, but he used a um, used a tool called site operations, and it's something to do with actors. I'm not totally keen on that stuff, but it allows the spine crawlers to be wherever he wanted, uh, attached nicely. He had to specify it though. It's not it's not like a five second job. And he also allowed him to uh, place them inside the Uberlisk so you don't see the building stuff that a normal spine crawler has. So anyways, I'm going to go demo this now. So um, if I attack here, you can see he has his regular attack that's uh, hitting these guys. And as well, his spine crawlers are all attacking too. And if I walk around, you can see the spine crawlers are actually uh, doing the damage right now off, off the Uberlisk's back. And uh, let's go attack move. All right, we're clearing this... Uh, random camp of spine crawlers that happen to be in the forest and why don't we go find out what's over here oh god alright wow the attack's pretty fast so um yeah it's pretty important to show that the uh... the spine crawlers pretty much work uh... nicely from their little spot there using site operations and um... yeah you couldn't really do this with attachment points because there aren't any on the head of the Uberlisk, but Prosaic Muse is a genius with the data editor, so he got this working, and um, that's pretty much the demo for this, so yeah, thanks for watching.